Well, hey everybody. Welcome again to another edition of Helpful Home Tips with Mike and Ruben. Of course, this is Ruben the Bulldog, my assistant, who's here to help out in fixing problems around the house, both small and large. Today, we're tra tackling one of the issues that everybody has in their home, or almost everybody has, and that is the drain in the shower is running really, really slow. So what do you do about it? Because you know that what's in there is filthy and nasty. I know, Ruben, he's ready and rare to go to fix this because he knows exactly what to do. But Ruben, should we show him? Let's get started. An easy fix at home, so your, your water will be flowing smoothly and easily right down the drain. Ruben's gonna help some pointers. So Ruben, why don't you lead the way? That's right. Tip number one, always get a good up, look, up close look at uh, what you're about to fix. So you've got a good idea of what you're in store for. So good job, Ruben. And yes, that drain is looking like it's, uh, well, full of junk. And uh, that junk may happen to be from a long-haired lady, also in this case known as Carol, who, uh, you know, can't help it, but some of the hair goes down the drain and gets clogged up. So we're gonna show you how to repair that and what it looks like to extract such a thing. Ruben, my trusty assistant, has handed me a screwdriver. And guess what? Ruben, it's Phillips head. This is a flathead. So again, make sure your assistant can see close enough the screw heads to get the right screwdriver for the job. All right, Ruben, hold on. Let's fix this. And we're back. And of course we have treats for the assistant because that's the only way we keep them engaged. Again, hard to find good work these days. So, we have the Phillips head screwdriver. We're gonna go ahead and remove the screws. Right, Rube? Careful. Make sure they don't go down the drain. And again, we like to have our assistants get a very good closer look at everything so that they can do this on their own. We lift the lid, which is already, avert your eyes, people, because this is about to get nasty. Ruben? Are you ready? <laughs> this is going to be bad news bears. All right, I know, he's rare and ready to go with the job. So, we've got the top, the drain lid off. Next, we have one of these, you can get at any local hardware store, and the little backward little flange is on here. You put right down a drain, and it's going to grab to the hair and pull it right up. Ruben, what do you think of that? No, don't smell the hair. That's gross. <laughs> My assistant is smelling the nastiness, so we're going to put that off to the side. Okay, Ruben, you're going to want to have paper towels handy. Ruben, come on back around. What? Okay. He's demanding payment as we go. He doesn't like being paid at the end of the job. He likes to be paid during the job. So, slow drains, bubbling up the foam. It's all about to be part something of the past. As we throw this guy down here, and we pull up, and I don't know, Ruben, come on back. Come on out. But what you're about to see, ladies and gentlemen, and Reuben, Reuben, you want to see this thing? Because it's not pretty. It's not pretty at all. And you may have to get your hands a little bit dirty or paws a little bit dirty as well. Sense the blockage of hair down there. Okay, ladies and gentlemen. The nastiness down the drain is so bad that Ruben has recommended we get a coat hanger because the plastic little thing was getting pushed around by all the big chunks of hair back there that are clogging that drain. So, here comes Ruben. Come on, back up. He's rare and ready to go. We've got the hook. We're gonna bend it a little bit. So it's just like we're fishing, except we're fishing for a large cat. Perhaps a calico. Perhaps just a stray. Either way, it's probably feral. And let's see what we get out now. Oh boy, we got a big one, Ruben. We got a big one. 
Oh boy. Oh, this is nasty. People, avert your eyes if you are not ready for this. Because this is down your drain as well as ours. But this is gonna fix that slow, that slow drain. Here we go. Oh, that's disgusting. Ruben, I know. Ladies and gentlemen, that is more than a little bit disgusting. But thanks to Ruben and his tips on reaching that nasty ball of hair and soap scum and everything else, you too can go ahead and fix your place at home. So pretty much that's that. Uh, I'd like to thank you for joining us this week with myself, Mike, and my assistant Ruben here. I'm showing you how to clean out a nasty shower drain of hair and nasty goop. But uh, just remember, a little tip for the future. Never ever marry somebody with long hair. Short hair is the way to go. All right? Okay. Ruben, thanks, buddy. Take care, everybody. To follow Ruben, don't forget to click on the red subscribe button, then click on the bell to be notified the next time a video comes out. Thanks so much.